This is a trade from the Glalie project, and because uh, this is almost like a TCBM slash FCB, actually, no, this is a, I think this is a trade slash sale, but because he threw in so many extras, I think I can safely call this a FCBM too. So he's just getting his own video because it is so awesome. So I'm going to start off with the note. It says the cat's meow. First off, I would like to thank you and a handful of other Poketubers for getting me back into collecting after a 10-year gap. Also, thanks for being my first online trade. I look forward to more in the future. All I ask is that you open the package labeled something special last. Never stop making videos, and best of luck in your Pokemon endeavors. The Glalie Project, aka Murray. P.S. Sorry for going a little overboard on the packaging. So I started to look through all of this, and then I realized that... I just kind of wanted to go through all this on video because we have in yellow construction paper the trade and then and I feel like this is one I opened up and I may not have the construction no nope, never mind um, and purple construction paper we have more extras and then those go with those um, yeah I think when I, when I opened up one and realized how much was really here that I was just like yeah this is getting its own video um, here we have in green construction paper extras and just, yeah, more stuff there. Just, oh, so much stuff. I love it. And then we have this giant thing. And this is something special. I started to open it up, and then I realized, to kind of take a sneak peek, and then I realized um, it's still really, really taped shut. And, uh, yeah, I was like, well, I think it's a sign that maybe I should just wait until the video. So um, I'm just going to start off with the trade and work my way through the extras, and then we'll go to the something special. Uh, so, the trade. Uh, so here we have a signature card. Oh, if I could get the signature card out. Oh, I'm sorry. Actually, the signature card is in a penny sleeve taped to the top loader. So, there is the signature card. The trade, Mewtwo EX. So, actually, I realize I am zoomed in or zoomed out quite a bit. Let's go ahead and get this. There we go. See that Blastoise better. So, if you've been keeping up with, and if I've, if I've honestly been keeping up with all the videos uploaded throughout the week, um, you've seen me get three Mewtwo EX in. So, this is actually kind of, this is kind of my goal was to get in as many as I could before Nationals. Um... Just because my best shot of, uh, of of selling any extras, or honestly, there's people still wanting to borrow some, and yeah, um, I want to make sure that you know my friends can play the best decks they can. He sent a Mewtwo promo card. Um, the code is on the back, so I won't show that. Don't want anyone to to steal the code. Here is the money for the sale. This is a Canadian, um, a, a Canadian trade or two, so I was so stoked that he was able to pay in USD um, currency. Didn't have to worry about, um, you know, arguing over currency exchange rates because really my bank is just ridiculous and it costs way, way, way too much to exchange currency compared to anywhere else. So that's why I don't do it. Um, let's go with, uh, I think, the first extras. Yeah, in the green wrapping. So, man, I'm not sure if these are all just code cards. Ugh. Yeah, all code cards. Awesome. The online game is still under maintenance, like for the multiplayer stuff, but man, when it picks back up, I'm going to have so many code cards stored up. Ah, we're in the double penny sleeves thing going on. All right. Growlithe, Arcanine. Igglybuff, Jigglypuff, Wigglytuff, <laughs> Totodile, Croconaw, Fur Alligator, that's a rare. Um, actually, I think, is Wigglytuff a rare too? Nope. Thought it was. Same with Arcanine. So there's a few lines there. Oh, we're in individual ones now. Lost World. Oh, Pokemon Catcher. I just traded away my last Pokemon Catcher, too, so this is awesome to get back in. Dual Ball. Another Dual Ball. Copycat. Another Copycat. Pokemon... Whoa! Two Pokemon Collector. Uh, three Sage. Three Interviewers. 
three pot, three elm, one rev fisherman, one rev elm, one rev pot, one rev copycat, and a rev eviolite. Lots and lots of awesome trainers and supporters. So much good stuff. And I actually, I am fresh out of Pokemon Collector. Um, I have some Rev ones left. But, um, yeah, so that's actually kind of nice to have a few more of those in there. Uh, so here we go with the second lot of extras in the purple construction paper. Eevee, Jolteon. Eevee, Vaporeon, Eevee, Flareon. I think we're seeing a trend here. Oh, I can't even see what's in this one. Um, let's do this. Special Dark. Ah, HGSS Dark. I'm still looking for more of these, just trying to have a whole playset of them. Rev Dwebble, Rev Carablast. Rev Timple and Rev Yamask. I've actually traded away a lot of my um, Dark Explorers revs, so it'll be kind of nice to to bump that part of my trade binder back up again before Nationals. Magby, Magmar, Magmordar, Surpe ooh, Superior Hollow. Ooh, it's been a long time since I've seen that card. A Zapdos Hollow from Arceus. Whoa, Rev Oddish, Rev Gloom, Vile Plume, Pidgeotto, Pidgey, and oh, we got those little backwards. Um, yeah, and, and Pidgeot. So Pidgeot's a rare. Uh, Pidgeotto and Pidgey are revs. Vile Plume is a rare, and then Oddish and Gloom are revs. So wow, these are so many awesome extras and whole lines of Pokemon. Relincanth, and is, nope, I keep thinking that that's a rare, but it's not. Um, Mime Jr. Rev, Tynamo Rev, Electric Rev, Fanfi Rev, and Donphan Rev. I think Donphan's a rare, nope, I feel, yeah, I feel like Donphan should always be a rare. It's just, yeah. Meowth, I'm actually kind of glad I say this till last. Different Meowth, a Rev Meowth, ooh, Manaphy. Uh, a hollow from Pop 9. Cool. And a uh, hollow Rotom from Pop 9, too. Those are cool old promos. So now we're on to the something special. So I'm just gonna. I'm actually gonna take this off camera because I'm trying to un undo it with the camera in between me and the package, and that's kind of difficult. So give me 30 seconds and. I'll get this undone. Oh, okay, so now that we're busting into this somewhat, we have this side up. And I think I might actually have to find my scissors for this. And get through all this tape. Well, maybe a little longer than 30 seconds. Yeah, whatever it is, I don't want to rip it. <clears throat> Let's get the rest of this construction paper off of it. These are awesome. Okay, so all the cardboard was to protect two drawings. And on the back of both of them, we have um, like their description, like what they are, and then illustrations uh, by, by him and his signature, Murray. So this one, we have the Gengar line. And that is a beautiful drawing. Beautiful. <clears throat> wow. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, beautifully drawn. Beautifully shaded. Just perfect Gengar line. And then we have a second one, which is why they were 
Oh, I love this one. Oh, I mean, I thought I loved that one too, but oh, this one. It's the whole Blastoise line with a, with a Meowth coming right there. Um, th these are just great. I've got some page protectors that I'm going to put these in to protect them. And, um, oh, this is, you, you are really, really talented. And this is just, this is so impressive. Uh, th these are just beautiful. And I think I was just actually showing the, the illustration with Blastoise's head chopped off a bit. So we'll back it up a bit. But, oh, th these are nice. Um, as, as you've been saying throughout my big booster opening, I've been featuring um, these cool drawings from Epic Ice 2012. Uh, one for Computer 3 NCSU and one for... Um, uh, the cat's meowth. I, I think in the future I'm going to try and start kind of having like rotating out my background pictures because this is just um, this is dessert. Yeah, there's there's so many awesome things I get in that I just want to show everything and I need a bigger art wall is pretty much what it is. So th thank you so much for the amazing trade, the amazing extras. A uh, little bit of a sale and so many free cards and these illustrations are just beautiful. Uh, I'm going to take very, very good care of them. And um, like I said, I'm going to put them in page protectors right now just to make sure that they stay in perfect condition. So again, that is the Galele Project. Amazing trader, buyer, Poketuber, all the way around. Thank you so much.